Hey, what's up, daywalkers and fellow travelers of the night? We're gonna do some mail call videos and we're gonna start with our friends from the Gray Malkin Gaming family. They were really awesome. We were missing some cards from the Midnight Sunset. Obviously, we bought four boxes, roughly four boxes, and we were missing about a third of the set, about 30 cards. So I reached out to them and they were really cool. Mr. and Mrs. Gray Malkin got back to me and said, hey, send us a list. We'll see what we can do. We'll give you a fair price. And boy, did they. It was so nice of them. They charged us basically a dollar a card for the ones we were missing, which was awesome. But then we also went a little step further because of their kindness, and we purchased one of their new shirts that they made with our friend Noggins, who did the artwork on it. So we're going to open this up at the end, so I still have that all wrapped up. But I just want to show off now that we have the full base set of Midnight Suns. This is so cool. This is what we wanted. I wanted to get this set back when Moon Knight came out, but obviously me and Blue agreed that our money would go to Moon Knight until we got all the autographs and everything that we wanted. And then once we completed that, maybe we would go back to this. And we got lucky with some of the boxes being on sale, and we got even more lucky when the Grey Malkins were like, hey, we can help you finish the set, no problem, we got a bunch of extras. So big thanks to them, big thanks to this community in general, and that's what these next few episodes are gonna be about, are things that Blue got me into to do with other people in our community, and then some stuff that I took the initiative on. And uh, it's just been awesome, like connecting with so many people. Now I know these don't go together. I have two greens here, and these aren't all in base color, by the way. Some are green, some are other colors. I think one or two's autographed, maybe. But I just wanted a full base set. I didn't care what variations or variants there were. I just wanted every, one of every card, and we got them. And then we're also gonna complete some insert sets coming up, so we'll make separate videos on those uh, and where I got those from. But yeah, this is just so cool that we finished this set. Like I said, I'm. I'm so happy to have gotten this because I did. I played the Midnight Suns video game. Obviously, we sold the Ghost Rider collection, which that video is coming out soon. Kind of my goodbye to that collection. Um, but I'm just such a huge fan of Midnight Suns. And I felt like, oh, man, I really should have supported this set. So, uh, And if nothing else, I should have just got a, a, you know, a set for myself, like just buy the base set from someone. But this was cool to finally get to some of the unboxings thanks to Steel City and then also to complete the set thanks to Grey Malkin. So I just wanted to quickly show off that our binder is complete, at least for the 100 cards. There's our guy Moon Knight. What's up? Um, Noble Kale. This is just so awesome. Robbie Reyes, Scarlet Spider. Oh, man. Ranter. We got everybody. Paradox. So it's cool. Finished the set. Got it. 100%. Cards up to 99 here. Uh, Venom there. And then our last card, Ghost Rider. And there are two other cards that we actually have coming in the mail, hopefully uh, soon. And uh, those are the two missing cards, card zero and card zero zero. They were only available on EPAC. They were an exclusive on there. Like if you completed a certain insert set or whatever, a base set, you would get access to these achievement cards. So there's a Lilith one and a Johnny Blaze one. So we'll be seeing those hopefully soon. We'll, we'll see. Um, so yeah, we're in discussions of about buying them and, and everything. So this is complete now, at least for this hundred cards. And we'll have some insert ones. And if those other cards, the zero and zero, zero come up, um, all those, we'll get to those as soon as they get here. But lastly, I just want to end this video on opening this. This is the cool shirt that you can buy at their gift shop. And they have plenty of other ones featuring the art of our friend Noggins here. Look how awesome that is. And this is Mr. Knight. Blue wanted a shirt from them. And I said, we got to do it, man. We got to support these guys, especially this creative endeavor. Just doing cards and being a part of that community is awesome. But to have your own business and create shirts and get original art on it is really awesome. So Noggins, you killed it. This is, you know, Blue's going to be so happy <laughs> that I finally opened this because it's been sitting here for a couple days now. So uh, yeah, really, really awesome. Um, yeah, I, I just got to show this off. We'll try it on everything, see if it fits. I think it is. It's an XL. So even if it's a little large, we can shrink it a little bit. But it's um, it's just a cool design. It has Mr. Knight on it. And we didn't really have any shirts with Mr. Knight just by himself. So we thought, okay, if Blue really wants one of these, do it. We'll just do it. So uh, thank you guys again at Gray Malkin. All of you, if you're watching this, and you want to reach out to them if you're trying to complete some sets, you want to check out their whatnot, you know, their, their streams on YouTube, wherever you want to watch them. I'm going to put links to all their stuff down below and to their store. Definitely support them. Buy one of these shirts. They have a lot of characters, Scarlet Witch, you know, Venom. There's so many great characters, all featuring the artwork of Noggins here, who's just killing it. So please go check it out. And I believe on the back, there's a great logo of the Grey Malkins right there, GGC, with Noggins' logo too. How awesome. So thank you guys. Thanks for watching this episode and we'll have more mail call stuff for you very soon. See you in the future. Peace.